When you pull up to the venue, you're just blown away immediately. You're looking up at just sheer cliffs, rugged terrain, and then people sprinkled all over it like ants with tools in their hands. The site is bigger than last year's. It's just a little overwhelming showing up and just knowing that you gotta find something in this vast amount of terrain to get from the top to the bottom. Ooh, yeah, it looks pretty good. <laughs> For me, the scary part is like, it's almost up there, more. The jagged, unrelenting landscape of Virgin, Utah, to some uninviting and nearly impossible to navigate. But to the elite in freeride, mountain biking, it is a paradise to push the limits. It's definitely a little intense, especially the first time you ride from the very top. It's like you get up there, you're like, oh, like, it gets real, real quick. Yeah, buddy, get it. We're competing against each other, but, Boys. you know, we're all a tight-knit group, and we're all rooting for each other. Huh? And at the end of the day, we're hoping each other comes out in peace, so. Here we go, Bearclaw, our first rider to go. Darren Bearclaw dropping in as he traverses his way down Rider's Left Ridge into the Green Goblin. It's only three feet wide right here. Huge vertical drop. Perfectly executed. James Dorothy drums right down the middle. Wow, look at the trail of Doug flying off his back tire. Oh, he's got his own variation on the start here. It's a double drop for Andrea with Carnegie. Landing right with the landing. And perfect, Tom Van Steenberg. And paints the line exactly like he did last night. Big step down. Aggie, so smooth. There's a lot going on in the top there on game day. It's all pandemonium. Definitely a lot to take in. Sorgi on course. Oh, Sorgi, I've got goosebumps right now. He's going to ride a similar line to Grand Axie. Massive! <laughs> Straight <laughs> airing and... A hip flip at the bottom! How did he quit that out? <laughs> Here we go, Cam Zink, drop it in. A 360 drop, did he land it? No! Cam Zink, right to his feet. He's got one last big jump for us. A flip, he's got a pull! This is where things are going to get big. Oh, and he's off. Oh, he is off already. Wow, what an animal. Carson Storch, run number one. Aggie, do you mind watching the flag right down there? Biggest feature in his line is coming up. And Carson Storch, 360 oh. on the huge truck. Carson Storch sticks the 360. And clean with the transfer. Kyle Strait's got something big on his mind right now. Huge yeah, extended suicide now, Anders. Tyler McCall, full full. Big extended super can. There's the front page. Still worrying about the wind here. Not too good, not too bad. Well, he wants to not only stomp his difficult line, but as we've seen, for the last three years, his dream of putting a double backflip into a rampage run. He may be able to realize that dream right now. Rider 11, Antoine Bizet. Here we Bizet. go, Antoine Bizet, making the drop. One of the moments we've all been waiting for here. Rider's right ridge creeping into this drop. We're gonna see him make his way to the middle ridge where there's hardly any space in between features. Now he's into the rhythm section. First hit, clean. Second hit, backflip, step down. Landing absolutely perfect. Another big drop from Antoine. Off the step down setup. Here's where we're gonna see it. A double backflip, can he land it? He did it perfect. Double backflip and ramping the first time in the history of the event. Yeah. 
action. Doesn't matter what action sport you come from, that is fantastic.